big investor in Credit Suisse bond says bail in system worked. Logos of Swiss bank subs and Credit Suisse are seen in Zurich. In this article, New York, Reuters, one of the largest investors of the Credit Suisse bonds that were wiped out in the UBS takeover of the troubled Swiss bank still. Believes in the value of the debt class and the bail-in system designed to save bank seen is too big to fail. Spectrum Asset Management Incorporated on Monday said it liquidated all its Credit Suisse positions during late market trading on Saturday before the contingent. Convertible debt, called cocos among traders, were written down to zero in the UBS deal. Valians were included in the Dodd-Frank Act to protect U.S. Taxpayers after the collapse of Lehman Brothers in 2008 so that they would not bear the cost of a bailout. Now banks in difficulty will be bailed in by the holders of COCOs, formerly known as additional Tier 1 bonds, at 1. Anybody that bought COCOs who didn't think bailed in had their head in the sand. Nobody likes it when it happens, but that's the whole idea behind COCOs, Philip Jacoby, chief investment officer at Spectrum, told Reuters. It's painful and it bleeds out to the entire system, and that's what happened. The bail-in worked, he said, adding that the integrity of the financial system overrode everything else. The firm's exposure to Credit Suisse at 1S represented 1.32% of Spectrum's assets under management, OM, on February.28. Spectrum's OM was $21.4 billion on December 31st, when it was the fifth largest holder of the debt, Refinitive data shows. In comparison, PIMCO Investment Management, which had OM of $1.74 trillion as of December 31st, held about $775 million of the debt at the time. PIMCO declined to comment. In 2021 and early 2022 Spectrum held about $400 million of Credit Suisse at one bonds, Jacoby said. The Credit Suisse debt represents about 12% of the benchmark for Cocos, a massive slice of the ice bofa U.S. Dollar Contingent Capital Index, he said. It's a big ship when you want to turn it, and it takes time, he said. We had been pairing back in Credit Suisse, had an internal negative outlook for a little over a year. Thanks for watching our video. Please don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Like and hit the notification bell so as to get our subsequent videos. We are the crisis to inspire change for the new age. See you at the top.